the representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Works and Youth Affairs, Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports and President of Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, received a number of first place winners from national sports clubs as well as youth delegations. The meeting was also attended by Youth and Sports Affairs Minister Hisham Mohammed Al Jowder, in addition to a number of youth and sports sector officials. Darjale volleyball player Mahmoud Hassan delivered a speech on behalf of the youth and sports delegation.
Darchley volleyball player Mahmoud Hassan delivered a speech on behalf of the youth and sports delegation, stating that great sporting achievements are facilitated by the comprehensive development strategy witnessed in the youth and sports sector under the leadership of His Majesty the King, the key supporter of this movement, and with the care and support of their Royal Highnesses, the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, and the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa. He added that these recent achievements are the result of the leadership support of the youth and sports affiliates, in addition to the efforts to overcome obstacles in elevating Bahrain status in various arenas. His speech ended with a renewed pledge to the wise leadership to exert more effort to preserve and enhance achievements in the future, praising the role of His Highness Sheikh Nasser in creating suitable conditions for the Bahraini youth, and he extended his thanks to all those who supported their mission. During the meeting, His Highness Sheikh Nasser was briefed on recent achievements made in the youth and sports realms, including Al Ahli Club coming in first in the 35th Arab Volleyball Clubs Championship, Darch Leib Club getting first place in the 36th Gulf Volleyball Clubs Championship, and Al Manama Club winning the championship title in the His Majesty King Hamid bin Isa Al Khalifa's Football Cup, as well as Bahrain being represented with first place in the 28th edition of the GCC Holy Quran and Hadith competition and the top three places in the International Invention Fair of the Middle East. His Highness Sheikh Nasser affirmed the importance of these achievements and the role of the wise leadership support, which created the ideal atmosphere for sports and youth delegations, in addition to the sincere efforts and dedication of the youth and national club players. His Highness stated that honouring young people's achievements is an initiative that is in line with the directives of His Majesty the King and a true embodiment of the generous care of His Majesty towards the youth and sports movement, which has reached a prominent position on the world youth and sports map during His Majesty's era. His Highness went on to express his keenness to receive the youth and sports delegations that have attained these honourable achievements in accordance with the strategy of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports that aims to appreciate the distinguished sons and daughters of the Kingdom. His Highness also noted that the accomplishments made in Bahraini volleyball demonstrate that Bahraini clubs have dominated this game on the Arab and Gulf levels. He added that thanks to the efforts of Ahli and Darch Leib clubs and their keenness to enhance the kingdom's status, the teams were able to overcome all challenges and display Bahrain's development in volleyball. He expressed appreciation to the management boards of both teams for their contributions to achieving the first titles on the Gulf and Arab levels. His Highness then congratulated Manama Club for winning His Majesty the King's Football Cup. He hailed the club's efforts to continually progress, which earned them the title. His Highness Sheikh Nasser praised the achievement of Bahrain in the GCC Holy Quran competition, reflecting the wise leadership's keenness to promote principles of Islam amongst Bahraini youths. He also hailed the achievements of Bahrain in the Inventions Exhibition, again made possible by the encouragement of the wise leadership towards innovation and creativity, and the provision of a suitable environment for the Bahraini youth to excel in all fields.